Hey guys, Matt here, and welcome to a first on my channel. Sorry I haven't been making any videos lately. I haven't really been in the mood to, um, kind of been slacking. I know, but, uh, yeah, so I, if you guys follow me on Twitter, you'll know that I got a PS4 recently. Don't have an Xbox One anymore, so a lot of the gameplays that you guys have seen, um, they're not going to be back. Um, I'm starting new series, new gameplays, so, uh, I... I, right now, I only own two games, which is uh, Killzone, Shadow, uh, Shadowfall, or whatever, and um, uh, Last of Us Remastered. But I'm planning on getting a couple games uh, soon, which will be very fun, plus Destiny and all that stuff, um, obviously. So, yeah, you guys will definitely no, not be missing out on any of the top-rated titles that are going to be coming out. But, um, yeah, so this is a pretty highly requested video on why I switched over to the PS4 from the Xbox One and uh, so price wasn't really an, a factor at all um, the Xbox One was more expensive so that that wouldn't have really mattered um, so yeah so I got got the PS4 um, for a couple reasons so one of my main reasons was because I personally don't play a lot of exclusives on the Xbox One, um, and a lot of exclusives on the Xbox One are normally timed exclusives, which, so they're always normally going to be available on PS4 or PC or whatever the other platform may be, um, eventually, and uh, so I'd rather go to a console that I actually play exclusives on, and if you notice, both the games I bought so far, they're both exclusives, and I both play them quite a bit, quite extensively, and the multiplayer on The Last of Us is amazing. Um, I really enjoy it. Uh, and, like, I'm obviously still going to get all the pre-orders that I have, because a lot of the pre-orders I have are multiple platform games, like Assassin's Creed, Destiny, and uh, Call of Duty. And it, it just doesn't make sense for me to go with something that's uh, kind of moving uh, as we're kind of moving into a next point doesn't get, make sense for me to get it on something that has a worse graphics processing unit um, which the PS4 has a better graphics processing uh, unit has better graphics capabilities and uh, in the long run I think this is going to be the better system to pick for that reason um, <clears throat> the PS4 is more focused on gaming um, so they kind of bumped up the graphics. They didn't focus on VRAM or anything like that. Um, they focused on straight up uh, video uh, video card quality overall. Or sorry, they do they did focus on VRAM, but uh, I think it's ERAM or something, ESRAM, something weird like that on the Xbox that they took out quite a bit of in to opt out of a better graphics processing unit. Um, which is kind of sad, but, uh, yeah, I mean, like, this game right here, this is a remake, like, a remake, an HD remake, even though the other one was already HD, and it looks amazing still. This looks as good as any AAA title game, like Watch Dogs or anything like that, um, that came out on the Xbox One or PS4. This is a remake of a PS3 game, and it still looks just as, ma as amazing, so, um, the graphics are definitely a big improvement. And, uh, for, I think, what is to be my last point, um, <clears throat> I don't use a lot of the features that the Xbox One has to offer. I don't really use, um, the console to cable feature, the HD cable box thing where you can just snap your cable or whatever. I don't really use the snap features. All these were kind of gimmicky. They sounded really awesome when the Xbox was first coming out, but... Now that I've owned it for a couple months, uh, like six or seven months now, actually no, eight months, it was eight months, um, it wasn't really that interesting to me, and uh, the performance on the system did, did lack, uh, with the UI, um, all that stuff lacked in performance, so I think that's why the PS4 has won me around this this generation. Um, one last note before I let you guys go with the rest of this uh, Last of Us gameplay. Um, I grew up on PS1 and PS2. And 
I think that's another reason why I'm comfortable to go to a system that I haven't played in a couple of years. Um, I also got the PS3 the year that it came out from my dad. Um, so I, I've had that since launch. So I've always had the latest PlayStation console. Um, and I think that's why I'm also pretty comfortable with switching over uh, late in the game. Not really late in the game, but um, you know what I mean. So yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please uh, continue watching for the rest of the gameplay will still be here. Uh, it's very interesting gameplay. If you guys have never seen The Last of Us before, definitely take a look at it. Uh, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you guys are new to the channel, uh, welcome. And uh, you guys will be seeing a lot more PS4 gameplay in the future. Some more unboxings. And uh, room tour. That's definitely going to be coming up this week. So, uh, yeah, sorry to all those people who I know request it so much. Um, but, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll talk to you in the next video. This has been Matt. And as always, peace. Good to go. Keep breathing. I got this.
Shotgun! Hunter. Uh, uh, uh. 